What's going on, y'all? How y'all feeling? Hold on. Can you hear me now? All right, cool. Hope everybody's out there having a blessed day. Hope everybody's out there being safe. We still masked up. Definitely sanitized up. Definitely roaming free. So, right now, I'm heading. I hear you. I'm heading to go get my first vaccine shot. So, I don't know if that interrupted my video or not, but I'm gonna keep it running just in case. So, don't hit me. So, I know a couple people. I know a couple of people who got their vaccine already and they seem pretty fine to me, you know, still functioning, no side effects, no, I mean, nothing out of the ordinary, probably a little headache or, you know, their arm hurt where they got the, the shot at, but other than that, you know, I mean, everybody's fine. The only bad news I be hearing comes from, you know, social media on the news or, I mean, whatever outlet you get your media from, you no, know, or hearsay. So, those are the only people who I hear that, you know I mean, got it bad. But you got to do what you think is right. If you feel you want to get the vaccine, then you go ahead. If not, then, you know I mean, you try to wait it out and see what happens. You no, know, but ain't nothing wrong with waiting it out or not getting it at all, you know what I mean? Everybody's entitled to, you know what I mean, their own, you know what I mean, their own, their own judgment. If you want to get it, you get it. If not, it's not. I don't think it should be a forced thing. Nobody should be forced to, to get the vaccine. You know what I mean? It's optional. Um, well, sometimes better safe than sorry. You know, I waited long enough, you know, because I ain't want to be... The first guinea pig out there. Let's go get the vaccine. Goodbye, mom. So I waited a little while, and a lot of people got it. And now they have several options of vaccines that you could get. You know, it's not just one. You know, other companies are starting to make vaccines. So you pick, choose, and refuse if you want. But um, hopefully. I mean, this puts us in the in the right direction of getting us back to to normal or somewhat close to it. You know, because I know a lot of people don't like being in quarantine. You're gonna quarantine me inside of quarantine, really? I mean, being away from family and not being able to do the things that they used to do. You know, so it kind of put us a little back. You know, as far as enjoying life. So. You know what I mean? If the vaccine is going to help us get there, then why not? You know, I heard some some of the news outlets were talking about um, vaccine passports. You know, if, if that was the case, then I think everybody is going to go get it, if you ask me. But, you know, I like to travel, so I definitely have to go get that. But, I mean, it's all up to you. What block is it? Sometimes I feel like a tourist in my own city, but I'm gonna take y'all with me. Oh, my ice cream! I'm gonna come back in when I get my shot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take y'all with me as I go get my shot, do the process, and I'm gonna let y'all know how how it went and all that. If I have any side effects, how I feel, and you know, see how good. A little be behind the scenes of I mean, what it's like to get a vaccine shot. So the location I'm going to is for um, city employees only. So it should be, well I'm early, so I got some time to talk to y'all and bore y'all to death. No, I'm just joking. 
I just want to make sure I'm in the right spot before anything. So let me let me see where I'm at, and I'm gonna get back to y'all in a little minute. So after this, you'll go into a waiting room where we monitor you for 15 minutes. You'll be through the same door you came in, through the double doors, okay? Okay. Appreciate you. Thank you. Congratulations. Okay, so now we're back. So, I got the shot, as you've seen. Unbutton. I'll get that later. But right now we're in the waiting room. So after you get the shot, you gotta wait about 15 minutes. So they observe you, make sure you're all right, and then you're free to go. Uh, right now, feel pretty fine. Uh, shot didn't hurt. I'm not really scared of needles, but uh, nice staff, nice doctor. I mean, he explained to me everything that I mean I needed to know, and if any complications or whatever. I mean, the most I'll feel is like arm pain. I mean, might get headaches, but he said uh, most females, I mean, get, I mean, side effects more than males. So I'm not really tripping if I do get a headache or not, you know, nothing new. So I'm going to sit here for about 15 minutes and then, if anything, I'm going to check back in with y'all and let y'all know how it went. 15 minutes later. All right. So. 15 minutes is up, let's go. Uh, but I wasn't so bad. Regular dagger. Um, if you used to getting shots, it's just another shot. My arm don't hurt, no headache, nothing, but I'm gonna keep monitoring it just to make sure, I mean, everything is good, so. I mean, like I said before, if you feel you want to take it, then go ahead. Or you want to wait, there's nothing wrong with it. Don't let nobody force you into doing something you don't really want to do. And especially society, because it seems like everybody's under peer pressure. I mean, trying to do it for the gram or your peers or, you know what I mean, your family or whoever. Don't let nobody force you to do something you don't really want to do. Right now I'm about to go into this ice cream shop. Hold on before I go in there. You know what? I'm gonna skip on the ice cream. I'm gonna skip on the ice cream. But I'm gonna find something else to get. Let me get the mango dragon fruit with lemonade. Uh, what sauce? Uh, grande. Uh, nah, just, just that for now. Yep. Beautiful. You too, champ. Life. But I want to thank y'all for tuning in. You know, thank y'all for. Subscribe and if you haven't subscribed yet, do it now. Click that red button. You know, don't forget to like, comment, share the video. You know, always be safe out there. Always put God first. Always stand on your ten. And we catch you on the flip side.